Hey guys, what's going on? So um, today I'm going to show you how to make this four-pointed star. Okay. And yeah, and this is what it looks like. And it stands nice and stable. Like that, on the surface. Alright, so here it goes. Alright, so for this model I'm going to use a square sheet of paper. Okay. And alright, so for a yellow star, yellow side down and fold in half. Okay, try to make very precise folds and crease sharply. Now, rotate and fold in half in this direction. Like this, like we're folding in half like this. Okay, just like this. Just make sure everything's sharp and stuff. Okay, alright, keep that folded. Okay, alright, and now we're gonna do is we're gonna, we're gonna make a pinch mark here and here. Okay, so to do that, let's let's first fold this edge to this edge. Okay, and remember we're not going to make the whole fold. We're just going to make a pinch mark here and a pinch mark here, like that. Okay, now unfold and rotate and do the same thing in this direction. So pretend like you're folding it in half, but just pinch here and here, like that. Okay, now unfold. Okay, all right. Now comes the kind of tricky step. We're going to do is we're going to fold this up. And we want to make this point touch this pinch mark right here. I might as well draw it with a pencil like that. Just make it like that. So we're going to make this point touch that pinch mark right there. And we're going to make the fold originate at this point, OK? Like this. OK? Just like that. And we're not going to make the whole fold. Pretend like, see, there's a pinch mark right here, OK? See right there? Pretend like this pinch mark is going all the way across. Like that, okay? And we're just going to fold from here. We're, gonna, we're just going to fold from this line all the way to this point, okay? It's like we're folding it halfway, okay? Like that. Now unfold, okay? And now let's do the same thing with this point. So let's fold this point to this pinch mark. Like this. And we're going to make the fold originate at this point. Okay, and just fold from this line right here, or, or this crease, it's this point. We're just going to fold from that point to this point right there. Okay, just like that. Now unfold, okay? So that's one side of the star, okay? And now let's repeat that all the way around. So let's rotate 90 degrees, and now I'm going to draw the pinch marks in so you can see them better. I'm going to draw them in as I go, okay? So fold this point to the pinch mark like that and just hold it there and now just kind of um, we're just gonna make the fold originate at this point okay and we're just gonna fold from where this pinch mark just pretend like the pinch mark is going all the way across to that edge and just fold from there to that point okay just like that now unfold and repeat that in the other point right here so fold this point to the pinch mark Okay, and just fold from here to there, like that. Remember, either where this line hits this point right here, or where this crease hits that point. Okay. All right. All right. Now, now the rest of them, I'm gonna go at my own speed. Okay. But hopefully, you'll get sense of how I do it if you don't remember. Okay. Like this. I'm, I'll just draw the pinch marks in so you can see them a bit better. Okay. Just make sure they're all drawn in. Okay. Okay. Just make sure I did that. Okay. Yep, yeah, I did. All right. Okay, and looks like, just make sure, yep, we're done, okay, we're done with the creases, okay. Alright, now lastly, let's just form the star, so, um, let's turn over so that the creases are mountains, okay, and now let's fold out right on this crease and this crease, like this, just mountain fold them on the existing crease, and do that all the way around, just mountain fold them like this, this should be pretty easy, okay. 
I actually like this part of the model. This is like my favorite part. Okay. And yeah, I'm just gonna shape it until it looks like a star to you. Okay. Best way is just put just push everything in like this, and and the best way is just kind of push everything in so it kind of forms like this. So it kind of almost forms like a pyramid. See, if you look closely. But yeah, it's just best to just shape it as good as possible. And once you did that, there is your four-pointed star. Okay, so there it is. Okay, so yeah, there it is. So it's not really an action model. Well, it's kind of an action model actually. If you turn it over, yeah, it can be a box actually. So it actually is that. It it actually is an action model. You can hold stuff inside like that. Okay, this is a cube right here okay and yeah this is Jeremy Schaefer's design right here okay that's that seamless cube with the with the mouth kind of thing in it okay and you can use the whole cubes like this this is my cube right here okay and yeah and I have a separate tutorial for this right here okay so yep this is that modular cube that I taught that time okay but yeah there it is there's the four-pointed star. All right. Comment, rate, and subscribe, and let me know what you think. All right. Bye-bye.